Oh, wait, what's the stuff about the tooth? Okay. So essentially, I have been a common experiencer of migraines. I don't know if you guys have been around long enough to like realize uh, how often I've been like um, experiencing migraines and stuff and how much I've been like, I, I had to cancel a lot of streams because of them. I was like really struggling to sleep. I was like nightmaring, nightmaring, nightmaring. Uh, I found out like, oh, I went to a doctor and he was like, oh, have you gone to a dentist about this? And I was like, <gasps> Dentist? So I went into a dentist for like an emergency appointment and they came back, um, they, they brought me back to the chair, they laid me down, they, I opened my mouth and they looked in and the dental assistant was like, she, she looks into my mouth and she goes, oh my God, you, you must be in a lot of pain, huh, sweetheart? And I'm like, oh, she called me sweetheart, ah, uh, yes, I am in excruciating pain. So when I, was, when I was younger, when I was like 14 or 15, um, I had three of my four wisdom teeth removed. One of my wisdom teeth was left in because it was like growing okay. And they were like, yeah, we can just leave it there. It'll be more expensive to remove it. So you'll be fine. Um, and <laughs> so that one wisdom tooth that they left in had cracked entirely in half and was somehow simultaneously pinching the nerve inside of the tooth and the nerve in my like jaw above the tooth. So I was having two nerves constantly getting pinched and it was like, <laughs> and they were like, yeah, that would cause you a migraine or two. <laughs> that, that would cause some problems. So you're like, okay, yeah, we're gonna schedule a surgery to remove the tooth and we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna do all this stuff for you. So, so they remove the tooth and they were like, okay, don't drink from straws for the next seven days and don't do anything funny. And I was like, oh, nothing funny. Oh, but everything I do is funny. No, that, that was fine. The second thing was not really an issue. Uh, although the dental assistant, the same one, this like really old lady, the same one who called me sweetheart. She was like, she was like, what's the Canadian equivalent of a Southern belle? She was, she was like, she, she had, she had, had everything but the accent of just like, oh yeah, honey, you'll, you'll be okay, honey. And all that stuff. And she's calling me sweetheart and stuff. And I was like, <laughs> um, she, on my way out, she was like, and, and you remember, okay? No straws and no sucking dick. And I was like, what the fuck? I was mortified. Like my face turned bright red. I don't do any of that. Like I, that is not, I, <laughs> I was mortified. I, she actually said that. Like she got in real close and she was like giving me all this advice. <laughs> it was fucking wild. It was wild. I loved it. It was... I, I, like I have a new favorite dentist. I have a new favorite dentist. She's great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she was warning me just in case. You know, I appreciate it. I imagine some other girl who just had tooth surgery and was like really out there like, man, I just got my wisdom tooth removed. I'm migraine fee for the first time in six months. Just, yeah, I'm gonna go suck a penis to celebrate. Like, <laughs> that's not me. That's not me.